hi friends welcome to testing tutorials point this is Lokesh and today we are going to discussing about how to add parameters to a method in a Java see uh, my previous video I explained like a uh, methods how we can able to create and what how we can able to access and this video we are going to discussing about parameters and also we can able to see here it is and we can able to create a static method and we can able to call it directly into a pro, uh, main method word method and we can able to sys out static method and this method we can able to directly on uh, previous video i explained like in the main method if you want to call it in main method and we need to create object for that and we need to access right now without creating any object and without referring and uh, just a copy paste and you can able to use directly method into that main class because this is main method as having static and as well as my method is having static keyword this static keyword without creating any object we can able to directly refer to that object okay and now we are going to see for creating the parameters while public while add numbers okay add numbers i'm going to give here and i'm going to providing the two parameters now i'm trying for integer parameter int a comma int b okay now i want to uh, here i can able to say return type as int now my return type up to here we used up uh, return type as a void now i'm using return type as integer now i can able to make it for string also we can able to do anything we can able to do it and based upon our requirement for the method now here what i can do a return a plus b and what is the value it is happened that value it will return now the error also gone right the return type is integer now you can able to take any kind of uh, integer like uh, not only integer string float any data type value we can able to take it and create for this method a return type we can able to use okay now if i'm going to call here object dot and numbers in numbers i need to pass the values one is five i'm going to pass second one is six okay now here what will happen it will take for some reference right to directly i'm printing for the value now you can able to run and see the value how much it will display for that see if i'm running then it will add that value on 11 it is coming right the same way we can able to do it for string also so now i'm going to do for public string and add string and here i'm going to do for return type string and here what happen i'm going to providing that string a and string b and int uh, string c okay and return type also we can able to specify and adding this is the one it is not a good practice and we can able to do it for a void also and if you return type return a plus b plus c and it will add concatenate that both the string uh, three strings and it will display and if you want to print a value for that particular method void add methods 
and that here we can able to specify some uh, int a and string name this value also we can able to print it six out and i'm going to make it as a a and the same thing i can able to go it for name also okay first i'll call this method here and i can able to add it object and for that you can able to this out obj dot and i'm going to mention this one and i need to provide integer value if i'm going to pass uh, like any value and you can able to see first i'll copy this, this one see if i'm passing other than the integer if i'm going to do for string then it will throw an error because the starting position value it is accepting for integer and if i'm going to do for float value again it will accept but it will give for some value and if you give true or false again it will throw some exception because it is accepting for integer string but the method is boolean and string it is taking like that it will provide and you can able to provide the string as a location and i'm going to make it this one the same one i'm going to copy paste into because we need to print all the values or because directly it is printing I'm not required this is out and just i'm going to do for running that program and we can able to see now 51 location it is coming to the console and we can able to concatenate the string for the string return type also and we can able to make it and i'm just i'm copy pasting here and adding this method into a return type here here all the string values are presented i um, location and each place i'm going to give some space because it is concatenating the two st uh, three strings into a uh, one place right to that i'm just i'm going to a space small space and once we run you can able to see i am location it is concatenated and it's written also do that we can able to do for boolean and we can able to do char also we can able to do it for string a written type here this is a way we can able to do it for parameterization for method and example i hope you understand this video if you like this video please like my video and please subscribe my youtube channel don't forget to share to your friends and colleagues thank you